Today, we're adding the soldier monkey to Balloon's tower defense. You can upgrade to get a rocket launcher, an AK-47, a chain gun, and eventually you can get the Paragon, but has limited ammo and needs to reload occasionally. In today's video, we're gonna be getting all three T5 soldier monkeys and then upgrading them into the Paragon. If you guys enjoy these type of videos, make sure to hit that like button. It'll change colors. All right, let's do this. I Let's get our soldier monkey. The one thing that I find really interesting is the fact that it has to reload, which I feel like is like kind of normal. Like you think about like, yeah, obviously you have to reload. Also, that looks so good. It's it's obviously it looks like Admiral Brickle, but he's like got a military uniform on with like the pistol. That's pretty sweet. I like that a lot. Most towers, why in the world do they not reload? Like snipers or like dartling gunners. They just have an infinite stream of ammo. So you can see the ammo up here by the banana counter. So it's like seven bullets left, right? And so once you're out of ammo, it actually has to sit there and now it has to reload. Oh my, wait, it takes kind of a long time to reload. But fortunately, at the end of every round, it does reload. But oh my gosh, look at how long it takes to reload. That could be really bad in the later rounds. We can go ahead and get bigger clips. Soldier Monkey can now hold 50% more ammo. Military Instincts, Grant's Camo Detection, and 20% reduced load time. I like that one. Focus Shooting. The soldier focuses its shot, greatly reducing its attack speed and ammo, but deals quintuple damage. What? Applies after all other damage bonuses and increased range. That is a really interesting upgrade, actually. So, you would re greatly reduce attack speed and ammo. So, you actually, this is a really interesting path. Bullets are much larger and pop lots of balloons. So that's actually not good for the beginning of the game because you want just attack faster. So I'm going to go ahead and just get bigger clip and then I'm going to get military instincts. I actually, I think this is going to be good late game because we'll want to do more damage, quintuple damage. Like that'll be really good against Moabs and ceramics. But right now it's just not going to do that much. So let's get military instincts. So now we can buy bypass cover. The soldier can now fire over walls and increased range, which I think is really nice. Having that extra range is good. I'm, this is so weird having this. Shots do more damage and pop more balloons. Which one do we want? I don't think we really care too much. I'm just gonna go ahead and just get another banana farm. Get my first banana farm. I'm just gonna throw, I'm just gonna throw down a, I'm just gonna throw down a banana farmer so I don't have to worry about it. Bypass cover, I don't really think either of those matter too much. Which path do we wanna go? I probably wanna go this top path where you get to chain gun. It gets like a, just like a turret. It's just like a, he's gonna be like a darling gunner. It's just like pew. So far, I love the, I, does it pop? Oh, but look at yellow balloons just fly right by. So that is kind of a problem. We are gonna need to get multiple anyway. So I guess I'll go ahead and just get one of these. And I think what I'll do is I'll get the focus shooting upgrade, right? So the soldier focuses its shots, greatly reducing his attack speeds. Whoa, look at the range though. Oh, look at how much slower it attacks. It does, it shoots so much slower. Look at this, boom, 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 boom. Okay. So larger bullets, bullets are much larger. I guess we can go ahead and grab that. Rocket launcher uses a powerful rocket launcher instead of a machine gun. I feel like that is gonna be better. Now the question is, do we want powerful rounds or bypass cover? I think I'd rather have powerful rounds where it does more damage and it just has a bigger clip. So it'll take longer to reload, but he'll have more ammo when he does. So he has 10 shots instead of five. I think that's pretty reasonable. It definitely changes it up quite a bit, which I love. I love towers that make you think about really what's the best cross path. Because some towers are just like obvious what cross path you need to get, right? Like some are just objectively the best. Like if you're getting a ray of doom, you just always get faster barrel spin. Like you just, you almost always get faster barrel spin, right? Like if you're getting a sniper monkey and you get cripple mob, you almost always want to get even faster firing, right? Like I feel like if you get bomb blitz, right, you almost always want to just get heavy bombs. So there's some towers, it's just guaranteed which path you're going to get, right? Like you go banana central, you're just going to get valuable bananas. Like you're just, it's just what you get. And so I love towers where you really have to think about, okay, what do I need for this instance? So there is a slight problem where they just both run out of ammo, which is a little awkward. I want to start getting a more increases to a more increase to our round. So let's go and get powerful rounds and armor piercing. So shots can pop all balloon types and deals more damage to ceramic and higher. So it's $2,000. That's expensive. 
and we'll get bypass cover because it's just a little bit more range. And so this leaves us with the AK-47. Shoots twice as fast, twice the bullets, and pops twice the balloons per shot. Ammo greatly increased. Honestly, focus shooting might be the better option with this eventually, but I, I don't know. So far, I'm a huge fan of the Soldier Monkey. I love it because mainly, if you look at military towers, there is no just like base military monkey, right? Like they're all a super special class, right? Like sniper monkeys may be your closest one, but there isn't any just default type of monkey, which I think that's really cool to have just your your default soldier monkey, right? Just like boots on the ground. He's got a little rifle. He's ready to blast some balloons. Uh-oh, 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 reloading, reloading. Man, it takes a while to reload. It takes quite a bit. I kind of want to just save up and get this AK-47. I think that's what I want. Shoots twice as fast. I think, look at, like, look how much ammo it has, too. 60 rounds. Chain gun is 17,000. That's a lot of bullets and pop balloons. I'm, I'm kind of looking forward to trying to get that chain gun up and running. Let's see, is this going to be middle path? No, this is going to be the rocket launcher. Okay, I kind of want to get the rocket launcher. I feel like the rocket launcher is going to be pretty cool. Right, the rocket launcher is gonna be pretty. Are we? Oh no, we're. I think we're in trouble. No. Oh, reload. Oh my gosh. Okay, this makes it kind of stressful. <laughs> kind of stressful when they're constantly reloading on you all the time. So we don't have a middle path one. So this will be our middle path soldier monkey. So military instincts, bypass cover, ammo assistant. Oh, assist nearby soldiers, giving them 20% max ammunition and pop two balloons. Does not stack. Okay, boom. Oh, that's so good. So they have way more ammo now. Oh my gosh. Okay, that is way nicer. Look at how much ammo he has now. Wait, actually how much ammo does he have? 72 shots. That's, I like that. Okay, unload. Increase soldier's range, ability unload. All nearby soldiers attack 24% faster and have infinite ammo for 15 seconds. I want that one, sign me up. And then we can just go ahead and get, do I want bigger clip? Or I think we're gonna stick with that. Okay, now, so if we're in a situation, I can just have the unload, and so, boom, they attack way faster, and then they just have, look at this, unlimited ammo! What? Okay, that's so good. That is so good. All right, we can focus now on getting us more banana farms. I kinda wanna get this rocket launcher. I like, I'm really wanting, I'm gonna get a rocket launcher. Oh, he turns into Striker Jones! All right, let's see how they do against, boom! Boom! I love that. I love that it just are guided missiles. Rockets are now homing with infinite range! Infinite range rockets? Dude! Stuns Moabs on impact. Okay, that's hype. Are we doing okay here? I think we're gonna be doing okay here. I wanna start upgrading all of these. Cause we are gonna need to get banana plantations. Cause I really wanna start working on Getting enough money to be able to get the Paragon. Paragon's $864,000. That is a lot of money that we have to save up for. And they're doing pretty okay by themselves right now. I don't think we need to get anything anytime soon. So, Ambush is $27,000. I guess I can, once I get all of these banana farms ready, set up, three, two, one. I just gotta pay attention to make sure they don't like run out of ammo on us. Because if we run out of ammo, we're kind of in trouble, right? Like that's, oh, but look at the missile. The missile almost one shots. Does it? I think it does one shot ceramic blue. So that's very nice. So let's go ahead and buy guided missiles. So that's an upgraded Striker Jones, which is super nice. That's actually so cool. So, oh, no, 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 no. All right, infinite ammo. Ooh, I had to get the infinite ammo button. And that way they still have infinite ammo, but when they run out, it's not as bad. So, I don't think there's anything that we need to save up for right now. Wait, portable nuke launcher, $200,000? What? Okay, always one shots the main target balloon. Wait, always one shots? While nearby balloons take catastrophic damage, but only hold one ammo. But maybe there's a way to bypass that problem? Wait a minute, what? So we can literally just one shot balloons. That's, that's what I'm hearing, is we can actually one-shot balloons with this setup. I mean, it already one-shots Moabs, which is kind of crazy. And, and it stuns Moabs, too, so we don't even need to worry about that. I think I want to go ahead... We don't really need anything right now, right? Like, we're fine. I don't think we have anything to, like, worry about. If we start getting swarmed, I can always use my ability so we have infinite ammo. 
in the meantime, let's just start getting more banana research facilities, trying to get as much money as possible for this. The rocket guy has almost as many pops as our AK-47, which is kind of impressive. He does quite a bit of damage. I think he's gonna pass him. He's got This guy's actually gonna get more pops, the guided missiles. And I think that he has infinite range, right? Does it say infinite range? We almost have the full banana research facility. We're about to go up against the BFP. And the BFP is always a little bit spooky. Always a little bit spooky. I feel like we're gonna just one shot it though. This guided missiles on the soldier is way too powerful. Let's see, he, I mean, he does have to reload. Oh, look at him, holy cow! He's so broken! That guy is nuts. This soldier monkey is definitely so overpowered. We don't even need to get any upgrades right now. Literally none. Here, I'm gonna go ahead. Let's put this guy down. I am going to save up and get that $100,000. All right, we can go up to like round 70. And we still are just fine. Like, we actually are still just completely fine. Do I need to get more? Ooh. I want to get the chain gun. It's $17,000. So let's go ahead and buy it. That's a lot of bullets. So, boop. Holy cow! What is this? It has so much ammo! And it's just a barrage of balloons, of darts. All right, there's nothing that can get past that. Okay, that's kind of insane. And the next one is Ambush, the middle path one. Unload lasts longer, has global range, damages and stuns nearby balloons on activation and grants affected soldiers double damage. This is definitely one of the craziest custom towers. This thing is wild. I love the synergies with it. I love how well it all works together. Like it works really well. It feels like you can get so many cool things with it. Round 80. I feel like we don't even need, like let's go to round 80. And we can just use, the, look at this. And we use the unload. Look at it, just double damage as well. That was round 80. That tower is busted. This tower specifically, 74,000. I guess the chain gun's really picking it up now. Wait, wait, I want to see something. Let's go to round 100. Okay, the BAD. Can it defeat the BAD? Oh yeah, it's going to be able to defeat the BAD. And we still don't even have the final T5 either. We beat round 100, we haven't even beaten the T5. Okay, portable nuke launcher. Always one shots the main target balloon. Boom. All right, so now we have the... It just, wait, it just one shot six. Oh, but it only has one bullet. That's the problem. So you can use the infinite thing, but he's still just like, look at how slow he attacks. So that is a slight problem. So let's go ahead and now we can get the one monkey army. Launches multiple nukes and switches to infinite ammo. So let's do this. So now we have the one mon Oh, that looks so good. What is that? What is it? This is outrageous. This is completely and utterly outrageous how powerful this thing is. What? Oh, and it still has the, wait. What is this ability? You clicked it. I don't know what just happened. I clicked an ability and it's nothing can get by. Wait, let's skip like 10 rounds. Wait, let's jump up to round 140. A fortified BAD, okay? Fortified BAD. It's gone. It was gone. It's popped. The fortified. Wait, are you. Bur oh, all right. We're selling all the banana farms. All the banana farms gotta go. We're at round 100. It has almost 9 million pots. Okay, round. Let's go to round 199. Round 199 versus the soldier monkey. He has global range. 11 million pops. So it shoots the... Look, see that big missile it shoots? That thing is crazy. And that's what, like, reloads, I guess. Because that can one-shot any balloon in the game. Literally any balloon in the game. So round two... Look at that! Fortified BAD on round 200 just gone. All right, everyone. This guy is insane. If you enjoyed, please hit that like button, subscribe. Turn on notifications, and we'll see you guys tomorrow for some more awesome content.